What's going on, all you ghouls and ghosts out there? My name is Mike Macabra, and I'm back with another episode of Reviews and Reactions. And on tonight's episode, we take a look at what we got here. Puppet Master, the game, official trailer 2021. Now, a little bit about um, this whole thing. Uh, I am very familiar with the Puppet Master movies. I did not know they were making a game. Apparently, it's been out since, like, 2015. Uh, they released, like, a demo, I think, and then 2017 or something like that. It released a multiplayer demo, and then now here it's 2021, and they're officially announcing the release of the game, which I think is, like, six, seven years in development. They're like, that's developmental hell, if you ask me. But I absolutely love the movies. Uh, the first three are my favorites. I kind of lost interest after, it's like, four or five. I think they have, like... 13 of them obviously is quite an exaggeration but i definitely ran it into the ground like uh um friday the 13th or nightmare on elm street as those horror movies tend to do but uh without further ado let's check it out huh all right here we are up at master the game let's check it out october games Howl at the moon. Oh, I hate bats. Uh, I have a phobia of bats. Mm. Full moon features. No thing must stop me from seeking you out and making each one of you do your knees for what you have done. And you will cry me mercy. A little loud. No mercy, my friends. No mercy. I love that guy. You will not escape. He's my favorite. <laughs> I like him a lot too. She was always creepy. But master the game on Steam. <laughs> Play for free late 2022. Do you heart Joe Blow Horror video? Subscribe now. <laughs> I think that's going to be just about it. All right. Yeah. It's quite interesting, not as long as I was hoping, but uh, we'll talk about that in the review. I'll see you in the review. All right, that was Puppet Master, the game. Yeah, I'm going to give this my lowest score ever. Two skulls out of five. Um, the graphics seem okay. Um, didn't really give too much in the way of what you're, you know, the game's going to be about other than you take control of the little puppets and you try to kill that guy. Uh, you know, kind of simple, simple game there. Um, but I'm just more excited to take control of the uh, the iconic characters. Um, I can't remember their names off the top of my head. It's been years and years since I actually sat down and watched a Puppet Master movie. Um, the Six Shooter Guy is my fa one of my favorites. Uh, the White Mask Guy and then the uh, Fire Guy. Um, yeah. Two skulls out of five. I just the graphics seem very dated. Um, not too much is in the way of story. The gameplay has potential. I think the whole game has potential. Um, I go, of course, I won't know that until 2022, late 2022. Um, the time that is taking for them to finish this game, this is, I think, is a little ridiculous, um, especially for <laughs> the way the graphics sit as it is. But uh, I'm not trying to knock the um, the game developers too much, or the devs, you know, I, I guess the, for be it, it being like a B-horror movie, well, you know, what, what should I expect, you know, well, I'm not expecting, you know, <laughs> the Shakespeare games or anything, I don't know if that's a proper uh, analogy, but it'll fit for what I need, I guess, but yeah, if you guys like what you saw, like, subscribe, comment, 
share the video, hit that notification bell as always, you ghouls and ghosts, and as always, stay scared.